Yo, what up, guys? It's the Don Pacey Blitz here, back with another video, and today we'll be doing a gameplay and review on the new team of the season so far, Radamel Falcao in the Turkish League. Good god, the links are gonna be terrible. But without further ado, let's get to the gameplay. It's gameplay time! Okay, finally moving forward with Falcao, and this man's pace is terrible. 86 pace is not helping this man at all for a striker. Finally makes it through, his positioning is really good, and he scores. I mean he had to score with 94 finishing, if he didn't score, yeah I would have burned this guy off immediately. But thank god he did, and the positioning wise he was pretty good to get past those two defenders there and finding some space in the middle. And, well, first time shot and he scores. Brilliant, let's go. Okay, it's been quite a while since the first goal, but we get back to Falcao and he takes a shot with his left foot, I could have went more forward there, but damn the 4 star weak foot on this card really helps it a lot. I mean the 3 star skill moves, little annoying, it's a little annoying, but Pretty decent, I mean we've used Iosi Perez, but the man had balance to like cater for his like 3 star like weak foot and that, but Falcao's not bad, but just the fact that it's he's Colombian, he's you can link him with James Rodriguez and an icon. But the fact that he's in a Turkish league, unless using other Turkish league team of the seasons, you don't really have much of options to like put behind him in that. Okay, we're moving forward once again, give the ball to Radamel Falcao and speaking of the man's 3 star skill moves, I was speaking bad about it, but it actually came in clutch there and a oh, beautiful freaking ball into the top bins. Top bins with these weaker foot, like the 4 star weak foot on this guy just makes it simply amazing. Okay, I've left the scene in to show you Falcao's pace. Yeah, that's terrible and he gets bodied, absolutely bodied by team of the season Pepe. Poor Radamel Falcao. Okay ladies and gentlemen, that's the end of the game and now it's time for the final summary on Radamel Falcao as the man gets himself a hat-trick today. I think he's scored every single goal with his weak foot, so you know that's definitely a pro already, but without further ado, let's get to the pros and cons. Okay ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the final summary on Radamel Falcao. Pros are in green and cons are in red. Now, he's pros, finishing, freaking amazing, positioning is good, dribbling, I mean the 3 star freaking you know skill moves is there but I'm fine with it. I forgot to put down 4 star freaking weak foot but well the he goes with the finishing but it's freaking amazing. Balance is pretty decent, speed 92 pace on the base card, on his base stat. Damn he's slow. Physical 88 but he got pushed down by freaking Pepe and there's a lot more defenders that have better physical. Links. In the Turkish league, Jesus Christ, and there's only a few Colombians you can link it with, other than that you have icons as a choice. So, I'm giving him a 7 out of 10. He's not that difficult to get, a little more difficult to get than freaking Ayosi Perez, surprisingly, and Ayosi Perez was freaking amazing, and if you haven't seen that video, go and watch it. So, thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to like, subscribe, and do everything else, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.